Hey guys, uh, big man here just messing about with uh, a couple of different microphones that we have. Uh, we're starting to get very technical at this old job here. <laughs> Today's the day that uh, we think, we hope, we pray that um, the 3650 has finally got the gremlins uh, out of her. Um, the story of the 3650 has been a very emotional story here at Grassmen. Um, there has been a lot of work over the years has went into it, but uh, from the bailing video the other day, you will probably remember that um, she was running well, but there was a little bit of a, a, a leak at it, so uh, at the orbital unit coming out around her feet. So brand new orbital unit in today, a Dan Foss 200, and... Um, we're back out in the 10 foot more just to give her a wee bit of a run uh, for her money and see see how she gets on, give her a nice, uh, a nice bit of warming up just to make sure. And I think some of the comments our fans have been putting in, Gary and I have been very keen to get it out there, that it's not all fancy 100,000 plus pound tractors. I mean, the Maxim is a super tractor driven tonight by uh, Big Greg, as we call him, Baby Bear. <laughs> and Gary's out with the 1365 on the... Uh, 3650 just giving it a run up so realistically you're looking at a cost a cost of about look we'll call it 40 grand's worth of tractors and two tractors and we'll call it uh, somewhere between 15 and 20 grand uh, between the two mores so when you add that all up you have two wee outfits buzzing about there absolutely perfect you have a tractor that's of great valuable use to the farmer throughout the year runs the rake can do all those little bits and jobs i know we try and get out and, and take part and help when it comes to the silly so that's what it's all about it's not all fancy rigs and fancy gears with us either it's just gary and i don't very often get the time uh, to show on camera us out playing uh just doing doing the thing sort of normal I want to play a little bit of a video now just to sort of showcase the journey of the 3650 with regards to mechanical repairs and I think in this little short video you will see that there was no stone left unturned. Lonely nights without your love In the days where I can keep from breaking up I don't have the strength to fight There's so many questions why I need To get them out of my mind My mind They say I should just forget about you But baby I don't want It's a time. 
3650 as that little video that we tried to make from years ago I've sort of saying this before I've actually got that bit of a video together but as the bit of video that you just watched should tell you <laughs> this tractor broke our heart and um, we wouldn't give up on it look She was leaking everywhere. Tea bag. She was a there. tea bag. Yeah. Well, here, character. That tractor's got character. Character's like a tea bag. Do they? Character's like she's you. She's a character. Or like... She's a character. Yeah. Do you know why character's like a tea bag? You don't know what you've got till you put it in hot water. <laughs> I'll not. I'll not take up comedy. I promise. But look. Like... <laughs> here she is, guys. Honestly, we're going to try and zoom in as close as we can. We do have this one. One little leak there. Which one tiny drop. That's now she's come straight in from mowing 10 acres. One tiny drop. There was a big puddle in there um, from that orbital unit. Well, been hard to tell. There was nothing else there, but obviously that orbital has cured a lot of it. But. This engine's nice on this side. The big question, is there any oil in here? That was a puddle of oil the last two times. Puddle of oil. No oil. No diesel either. No diesel. This was absolutely peeing out diesel, so we get a seed kit and guys sort of that. There's one tiny little issue. But it's well sorted. Now that could be just. There's an oil leak there. A wee bit in at the back here, the engine, but when a tractor sits a long time. It has dried up a lot. It so has dried up a lot, so we're a wee bit unsure. But this is the one part of this tractor that we have never been into. No. And we needed this bit running to get everything else sorted. So really and truly look a lot of experts out there but that could be anything from gasket which I don't think it is because there's no mixing or anything like that there. Gasket. No. But you know what's it's engine oil and it's coming out there. Stem yeah. seals or something like that. I don't know what it is. Valve seal or has to be some wee thing but that's it. Like I mean folks I, I know maybe it's maybe hard for me to get the light in there but like that, that that's it. That's it. What she was. <laughs> That's it. I'm happy. <laughs> what a project. <laughs> what a project. More on good guy. Ah, nice it's nice to nice finally mower, get huh? the more doing what it's here to do. Four to sure, four to thirty six. So yeah, guys. There's no holes in that, I know. Maybe not. Good tight more. So she managed the more. Next challenge. Fast track. Wagon. Wagon. And then buck rake. <laughs> no. Oh, I don't know. Camera. Oh, this guy's camera works turning into a full time job, you know. I, I think I'm going to need a couple of new cameras. 